Do you think that your opponent's body type really matters in a fight? You'll see real giants of no rules fighting against their smaller opponents. On December 31st, 2007, all fans of fighting with no rules watched an amazing fight with Fedor Emelianenko, and he was opposed in this fight by just a huge Korean hongman Choi, who was 7.6 feet and weighing 363 pounds. It should be noted that Fedor's weight was 233 pounds and his height was 6 feet. Although Fedor was not small, he looked rather small against the background of this giant, which in principle did not prevent him from winning. And already in the next fight, Hong Man Choi meets the little Japanese Ikuhisa Minowa. The athlete's height was 5.7 feet, which was as much as 1.4 feet less than that of the Korean. However, Ikuhisa Minowa was a very experienced fighter. He fought 101 fights and won 60 of them. Now we will talk about some real heavyweights, and the first of them is Chad Rowan, better known as Akabano. This is a giant 7.6 feet and weighing 496 pounds, a former sumo wrestler and now performing in mixed martial arts. On December 31st, 2004, an 176 pounds fighter from Brazil, Royce Gracie, a master of jiu-jitsu entered the ring against him and eventually won with a submission move. one in the history of fighting with no rules was Emmanuel Yarbro, who weighed 595 pounds with a height of 7.6 feet, also a former sumo wrestler. By the way, his maximum weight reached 881 pounds, for which he got into the Guinness Book of Records as the heaviest athlete in the world, and he lost to a small Daiju Takes in 1998, which weighed only 182 pounds and was 3.2 feet. spotted that the bigger they are the harder they fall. Often, such so to say dimensions are only an obstacle for the fighters. Judging by the statistics of the fights of all the giants presented, they often lose than win. So, in fights, both the height or weight of your opponent do not matter. That's all for today. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and share this video with your friends. See you in the next video.